This is Louis Giordo with RxMuscle.com here at the Tournament of Champions Pro Figure in San Diego, California. Coverage brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. I'm here with Josh Field, uh, co-founder, coach of Team ABC Fitness. Correct. Co-coach Team ABC Fitness with Victoria Adelis. IFBB Pro Victoria Adelis. IFBB Pro Victoria Adelis, absolutely. So speaking of pro, Victoria is actually a figure competitor. She didn't compete today in the, in the pro figure, but there were uh, 25 competitors on stage very good high caliber people yeah I, I thought so I thought it was another great uh, muscle contest show the lineup looked really good the girls looked great so um, hats off to another successful show so there are a lot of competitors not making the top five let's really start off with the, with the winner the overall champion Karina Grau last year she did this show she was in the very last call out didn't even make the call out this time she's number one what do you think? Can you think making that much change in a year in, in your physique and maybe your presentation? She turned pro in Paraguay in South America. So I know down there they're a little harder and they also pose different. They pose like the old school figure girls. No, absolutely. I, I think a lot can be done in a full year. Um, it, exactly what happened with Karina. You know, last year she wasn't doing so well and she came out tonight. I didn't see the prejudging. I was only watching photos. But tonight during the finals, when she came out, I think she had the best of everything. She had the flow, the conditioning. Um, I think everything was there. I mean, clearly she made the, the, the improvements uh, necessary to take away the win tonight. Which would be the second place with Sasha Brown. Sasha, no, I've seen her look a little better. I think maybe she came in her best. She may have contended for that first place spot, but I think that being a little bit off, maybe a little bit flat or whatever, I mean, I'm not an expert. I can't tell between flat or, or lack of condition. Uh, to me, they the same thing in my book because I, I can't tell. But Sasha came in second. She has a very good stage presence. No, absolutely. I love Sasha's stage presence. She comes out. She's very uh, elegant. She has um, a great sex appeal to her. I, I think it's great. Um, from what I heard and talking with her earlier, she was sick, I believe, during pre-judging. Um, I don't know exactly what was going on, so I think that may have attributed to her being a little bit on the softer side. Um, I've watched Sasha since the beginning of the year. I believe it was at the, uh, the Emerald Cup and the Cal Pro, and I too would agree that sh she was a little bit off for her. But the best look I, I think I saw her, I think I saw her at Dallas Europa when she was in the last call out. Which sometimes you, that happens. Which shows you how good I, I'm at, how, how good my eye is. Yeah, sometimes that happens, you know, j just like you said. Uh, the winner tonight, Karina, last year she wasn't placing, comes out. Um, I don't know what show she's done prior to this show this year, so I'm not exactly sure, but here she is, comes out, and boom, she gets a win, she got the old qual. Yeah, in third place, Julie Meyer. I'm a big fan of Julie's physique. She has a more muscular physique kind of condition. Glutes are always hard. You know, I think she's just she's missing maybe one element to get her into a win. I don't know what that element is. Maybe maybe you can throw some light on that. Being an expert, you know. <laughs> I don't think anyone's truly an expert in, in this. It, it just depends where the cards fall each day. Uh, I myself, I'm a huge fan of Julie's physique. Uh, she's a good friend, and same exact thing. She's always right there. Last Last year, I know that she had some hurdles. She's been really consistent this year. She always brings good conditioning, a little bit more on the muscular side, but I personally, I like that type of physique. Kind of the same exact thing. I think really the only critique with her is just con to continue to work on that V-taper. I think if she's able to bring the lats out a little bit more and, you know, what she can with the waistline, she's, she's right there. You know, that would be my only critique. She just got six or seventh or so in Chicago last week, so she moved up and got a little more points towards Olympia. I believe she's right there in the point standing. I, I'm not exactly sure where she is, but a lot I, of girls right there, right now. Everyone's in the same point, Brad. Is. Exactly. Um, so I don't know what her plans are moving forward, but of course I would say she's on a roll. Keep cruising forward, and I would love to see Julie on that O stage. Speaking of cruising forward, Latoria Watts getting her fourth fourth place in her in her competition history. She did get third earlier in the year at the Cal. Classic comic book physique almost. I, I just think she needs to be just maybe a smidge tighter, and I think she'll be there. Me personally, I love Latoria's physique. I think, hands down, I think she could be right there in that. I may be throwing myself in the deep water here, but 
she easily could be a, a top six, seven Olympia contender. Same exact thing that always seems to be to be the critique with Latorius. You know, it just needs to be a smidge tighter. But just like you said, I mean, just phenomenal physique, phenomenal comic book structure is what I call it because exactly. she looks like one of those comic book superheroes like Rogue or whatever in the magazines. Oh, ex exactly. Um, her and Candace Lewis, I think, have excellent physique, and obviously Candace, um, she's right there, one, one of the great top O contenders. And kind of like a kind of like a mini mini Latoria in fifth place was Jessica Canty. She had the same similar kind of structure, the little waist, and the, but she's like the mini version. You know, I'm not too familiar with her physique. Um, I believe she's a new pro, um, to my understanding. The same exact thing when she came out. I didn't know her. I didn't know her physique. And I was sitting next to Victoria at the finals, and I was like, oh, wow, she's got a phenomenal physique. Who is this girl? And just like what happened tonight, she pulled off a top five. And notable people outside the top five, uh, Boyana Vasilovich got third last weekend in the, the Chicago Pro. Becky Body's gotten uh, top five at the New York Pro. And actually last week, I think she got six in Chicago, both outside. I think Becky was a little maybe uh, softer from the glutes. And Boyana, I think she could have been maybe 5% harder from the glutes behind. Yeah, I've, I've been, I don't want to say her name because I'll probably butch. But Boyana Vasilovich from Serbia. Thank you. Yes, I've, I liked her physique ever since the first time I saw it last year at the St. Louis Jack and Antitone show. Um, when she came out, I was just like, oh my goodness, look at that waist. The waist, yeah. Exactly. Um, and she's done well at some shows and other shows she hasn't done so well. But I think last week, obviously I wasn't there, um, she pulled off a top three in which it seemed to be the type of lineup where her physique flowed with that lineup. Here, I don't think the physiques went with her type of physique, and I think that's why we didn't see her in the top five, but her waist is just unreal. Yeah, she matched up well with uh, uh, Lori Green. Yeah. And uh, w Lori Green, Wendy Fortino, and um, Sydney Gillian. Yes, exactly. Thank you. So, that's pretty much the lineup here. There's a lot of good competition here at Tournament of Champions. I'm here with Josh Field, Team ABC Fitness, right? Yes, sir, with ABC Fitness com what's a website teamabcfitness.com or info at teamabc teamabcfitness.com <laughs> well, there, there you have it long day here in San Diego at the tournament of champions I'm here with Josh Field from Team ABC Fitness I'm with RX Muscle contest coverage brought to you by Iron Mag Labs the most potent hardcore supplements in the market today